Hi, I'm Cal. This is Bernard, and we're gonna play Terraria. Say hi. Thank God we're finally gonna. Is this gonna work? Is okay. this gonna freaking work? So I really hope this is gonna work. I'm starting the server off, and we've tried to do this so many freaking times. And we're doing this for you. Like the a millionth time we've tried to do this, but for some reason my inventory isn't showing up, or my mouse. Oh yeah, that that's just you pressing uh, an F something button. Oh god damn it, that's my record key, it's F11. So I'm gonna have to go out and I'm gonna have to change that now. Oh. Motherfuck. Alright, I am Cal. I am Bernard. We're back for a second episode of probably this time I have my connects. And fun. Oh, screw you, I want my connects. Mm. So yes, Lovely. Nice. we start this episode off coming to you from middle of the night time. After killing each other last episode. Yes. If you did not see last episode, you might want to kind of explain who we are. But in this episode, we're going to explain how we met. Oh, how okay, your sure. Mother, kids. Except he's not your mother. I really hope. I wish. Know. How could you be a mo- oh yeah, transgender. So yeah, if you guys ever- if Bernard ever gets a transgender operation and becomes a mother of multiple children, uh, or just a child, this is how I met your mother child out there, who hypothetically could exist and probably never will. So child, this is how I met your mother, Bernard can't- Wait. Wait, okay, um... Okay? Yeah? Okay, okay. Actually, that's a reference to... One of our instructors on the thing that we're gonna talk about. Um... We met at the summer program for the talented youth or some shit. And then, uh... Except not when we're playing video games, because I have fucking zombies. And I rage, like, hard. Like, uh, like, we out really hard, hard. But, like, so, so hard. Like, oh my god, oh. so hard. No, when I was, um, playing with my friends, I was playing Halo at my friend's house, and I was on the verge of breaking a controller because I was smashing it so hard against my lap. Nice. Alright. So, yeah, we met at Smart People Land. And, I had to and he liked games, and I like games, and we like fun. clicked. Wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. We both like games, and we just became great friends because of it. And now we're still friends. And we play games. And yeah. So and, and then, then one day I started recording games. stuff, and he was like, "Damn, I want to record some stuff." So I was like, "Hail to the yeah!" And then now he records stuff, and we all play video games together. That's really fun. Oh! I can oh. Eyeballs, eyeballs, eyeballs. I'm the only reason I'm, I, I'm going away from our fortress is because I left a gold coin over there. At my death point. It was a gold coin that I saw. And crap! I need to go back and get that gold coin. How long will it be there before it despawns? Do you know? Like five seconds? Five seconds? Oh, okay. I have no idea how this works, I'm just kidding. Let's hope it's a really long time to get that time. Damn it! I just keep getting myself killed by zombies and eyeballs. So that's how, so that's how I met Cal. Um, yeah. I met some other cool people there too. We don't really keep in touch with them because we're dicks like that. No, I, I still keep in touch with Sarah. Oh yeah, and I kind of keep in touch with this one girly. But then we stopped talking. So my friend texted her that Catherine. I was gay, and she said she suspected it all along, and then she denied that when I told her that it was my friend. Catherine? Yeah. And Catherine was his the love of his life. Until I realized that she lived really far away, and then I was like, I still like you, but we'll never be together. She was like, 
yeah, that's probably better. And I'm like, what'd you say? And she's like, nothing. I'm like, okay. That's nice now. Sad face. No, but like, I didn't even understand in this little story. She was, like, rejecting me. But I actually do. But that version of me didn't. That little version of me in that story. Oh my gosh, it's still there, but I'm on such low health and there are two eyeballs. Fuck, I died right next to my old gravestone with a gold <laughs> coin there. Well, I'm like farming demonized. There's three coming at me and I'm just like perching here, killing them all. Nice, dude. I need to go oh, get here's stars. Look, another eyes. Oh, a couple eyes are coming after you. Yeah, but they're probably gonna come at me because I'm actually out here. Yeah, screw them. Come on, dude, help me out. I need all the distractions I can get. Ah, oh, fuck you, man. <laughs> yeah. But now I like it. Oh, we could get it. I'm going out with my best friend. If either of you are watching this, I kind of awkward for you to figure it out this way. Well, the girl already has it, but my best friend, he doesn't. So, Luke, if you're watching this, yeah, that's true. Probably not gonna tell you about that. I that's do true. Thought, you know. Got me. But anyway, um, cause you watched a lot of YouTube. Yeah, I don't like talk. I don't like talking about my love life because my love life is either very simple, or very complicated, depending on the time of day. So. Uh, okay. Cool. Like at night, I'm a vampire, and you know my love life is complicated because I have um, hormonal teenagers chasing after me. But then <laughs> that's why we have hands, Bernard. To touch you? Yeah, when you get hormonal like that, there's hands. Oh, oh! You're I'm saying hormonal. the girls are hormonal. Don't you just I'm love that jokes on our second episode? Yep, okay. That happened faster than I thought it would, I'm just saying. That's what she said. Eh, would. Faster than I thought it would. No, faster than uh, I thought it would. Come on, that is a premature ejaculation joke, and it was great. You just don't know how to appreciate good, sophisticated humor when you hear it. Keyword. Good, sophisticated. Good, sophistic good sophisticated, immature humor. Indeed. Best humor I ever. I see you like running, like and being chased by five zombies. I'm just like chilling in my car, going like, "Yep, it's the idiot I live with." Wait, you live with me, IRL? By the way, Our we do not live together, IRL. That would be gay. Nothing wrong with being gay. It's just we're not gay. Yeah. Um. <laughs> That's a cool transition. We should always just say that in every episode. Be sure to reiterate that we're not gay. I'll just I'll just have people wonder if we're gay or not. But we tell them that we weren't gay. We're like we're not gay. And they're like, okay, cool. We're not gay. We tell them again. They're like, okay. You told us that last episode. But I can let it slide because I'm assuming you just forgot. You know that you already told us that you weren't gay. But whatever. And then the third. Time, they realize that Cal is so conscious about his homosexuality and. Which is why he's constantly reading himself why he is a heterosexual. Why would it be like concerned that I'm not gay? I'm not gay! <laughs> uh, well. Just waiting for morning and all of them to die. <laughs> oh, they're all going away. It's almost morning. It's morning! Oh, seriously? Oh my gosh, yes. I should wrap the night and I got my gold coins back. I'm just doing so much damage to these zombies right now. Owning them in the face. With my pickaxe. Early morning. Oh, I see them. Oh, look, a bird. Oh, look, it's Superman. I like how we have. Have we even crafted a freaking uh, crafting bench yet? Fuck no. Alright, today's, today's goal, build a home. Stop getting distracted by caves and build a freaking home. By the way, if you guys are wondering, world size is medium, and we're playing on softcore. I love softcore things. <laughs> oh, I also introduced to, um, 
Uh, I, I introduced Cal to this awesome HP Lovecraft. Some may call 